What's up, everybody? It's your boy Lionel Jinx here, representing WWE 2K Dev once again. And in episode two of the WWE 2K Dev Spotlight series, we're going to be talking to one of our animators, Preet Upple. And he's going to walk you through what it takes to get mocap data into the game. Now, we ain't going to show you the game just yet, but he's going to show you how we get a game ready. So I hope you guys like it. Check it out. My name is Preet Upple. I'm one of the cinematic animators here at 2K. Uh, so I work on the uh, cutscenes that are uh, in the game. Uh, some of the entrances, victory scenes, uh, scenes that are in uh, career and universe mode. We've got characters interacting with each other, sort of between matches, before and after matches, things like that. Uh, and I uh, work on uh, putting them together, cleaning them up, making them look cool so you guys can uh, see them in the game. Uh, we also have uh, motion capture, which is uh, which is shot the studio down the road, um, and we have uh, a bunch of uh, professionals, that, uh, professional performers that come in and will act out uh, scenes. Uh, there's a lot of cleanup involved, so we get it kind of raw and it's uh, it's a little bit messy, but it gives us kind of a base starting point to go from. And then we have to do a lot of uh, additional cleanup, like foot placements, hand placement, hand poses, gestures. Our uh, performance capture, though, it's really great and helpful. It doesn't do things like capture, like uh, proper hand and finger motion. So we have to put that stuff in manually. Um, and then once that's in there and together, we then go in and uh, add facial animation. We have to do that by hand. Uh, just so we can try and get all the, the nice little ticks and nuances that all the different superstars have. Um, so yeah, there is a, so the, the motion capture process gives us kind of like a good base starting point, but then there's a lot of like cleanup and polish that has to go into it to actually make it look good for you guys to play in the game. And that's going to wrap it up for this week's episode of the WWE 2K Dev Spotlight Series. I want to give a big thanks to my man Preet for helping us out with this week's episode and giving you guys a behind the scenes look at the animation process on WWE 2K18. Now we have a lot more to show you guys in the weeks to come. So I hope you guys stay tuned and I hope you guys like what we show you. So until then, I'll see y'all soon. Peace.